Hi guys, and welcome to this week's update with us RGJ Trains at Dabby Junction. So, bit of an unusually close up, I know you're really scarred for life now. The reason being is I'm kind of hiding something behind me and nothing we could do could actually do it. So unfortunately you have this close up to start with. But, that'll bring me so... Rob, as you know, we started this up again because of his HSTs that he had when he was younger and something that he always wanted to replace, we never got to keep unfortunately, never survived through time, was um, an item that he, he loves in real life and an item that we've tried to source for a while. I, I, I do kind of point this, these things out everywhere. Yes, again, whenever we? we see them. Oh, so, look at that one. Ooh, yes. Look at that. Oh, Liverpool. Yes. That yard of them. Yes. Yeah. We like that one, that one, that one. So anyway, guys, yes. So leading on to this, a big thank you from Brian at Finnis and Central. From two. To Brian at Finnis and Central. From, yeah, I mixed up my two of my proms. Um, and he had put us onto Elaine's trains. Now, I know she's at shows as well. It's just not a stand we'd ever really gone up to or knew. So Rob got in touch with Elaine, lovely lady, her and her husband run it, don't they Rob? I think it's a husband or partner. Uh, partner. Sorry if you're watching this Elaine and it isn't. Um, but we now have a crane. So a few people that know Rob probably do know that he likes his cranes and things like that. Um, so we do now have a crane and the condition that it's arrived in is just amazing. It looks brand new. The box, a little bit of wear and tear because of how old it is. You know, just the um, colour itself has gone a bit, but it looks spanking brand new. And it even has all of the support hooks. Yeah. Which is something that doesn't happen very often. So obviously somebody's a very happy bunny right now. Uh, I, I like cranes, but... And that's a childhood kind of thing. I was going to say, it's a mix place. of the two. I have a fascination for mobile cranes. Um, but I had one of these when I was little on my track alongside the HSTs and it's something I wanted to replace alongside the APT that Jason got me. I, well, I paid for it, Jason picked it up. Um, the other thing that was missing was this Hornby crane. Um, I spoke to Brian, he managed to get hold of the yellow one and I said to him, I said, please, 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 please keep an eye out for another Hornby crane. I don't care if it's yellow or red. Um, all of the chains as Grace is showing, all of the chains are intact. The winders work, the all the wagons are there, the supports and everything. It's absolutely mint condition. So thanks for, to Brian for putting me onto that. And Elaine's Trains, I suggest you actually check them out. Um, Elaine's Trains.co.uk, but just search Elaine's Trains in Google. Their stock is massive. Phenomenal. It, it's ridiculous and that's for all, all, you know, all types, double O, N gauge, you name it. Wagons, diesel, steam, track, accessories, everything you can. We're not being, we're not being paid yeah. by Elaine or sponsored by. But credit where a, credit's due. But cre I, I did say to Elaine, credit where it's due. Yeah. Um, thank you so much, Elaine's Trades, for that incredible find. Back so to Grace. Guys, now we've seen this, um, we have got bits ordering that are coming this week for Rob's section. He's going to get onto that on a minute, what he's going to do. Um, but my plan is, again, obviously, the thing we really need to get sorted now is these walls. They're looking very blank, but as everything starts coming together, we've got to work our way inward. Um, especially with the TMD section, obviously, the mountains, all of that coming together, we really need to crack on with filling the wall. I don't know how much of the scenes I'm going to do throughout. Rob still wants that scene over on the extension area. Um, so I actually had a comment. I cannot remember the name. I apologise to someone about saying, why don't you add like mountains in the background, a bit of shadowing. Um, that is something I'm going to go back to that drawing board and have a practice with. That, that um, was Alex Faulkner. At Alex Faulkner. Thank you very much, Alex. Um, so yeah, we've had some very good tips and tricks this week. I know Rob, as soon as the episode was posted, I was out of work and all that kept coming up on my phone was notification, this about the TMD, this about points, this about that. So thank you everybody that sent us in advice, whether it's about the artwork, the airbrushing, or Rob with his help with the points and what to do with the TMD, because literally it was going off on Sunday, wasn't it? I was on shift and it was just literally every five minutes so a big thank you there 
And then Rob, I think, is going to get on this here. Oh, yeah, I'm going to go back to my practice piece for these mountains. Can't promise they're going to happen. You know this. I'm self-critical, but... Google is your friend. It's not just that. It's my own ability. And you could always respond to Alex Morgan as well. Yes. Can you tell me my piece? Yes, so swap these. Um, Rob will let you know what he's doing because I have no clue with these things. Hello, everybody. Right. Um, first of all, we... Um, what's the word I'm looking for? Oh, yeah, the responses. I asked for, asked for major feedback because I was getting seriously confused. I didn't even know what a curved point was, to be honest, even though I had one, apparently. I don't know where it's gone. But we have one. Apparently, we do have a curved point. Someone spotted it in the video. Oh, I don't know. Um, so, yeah, we had a phenomenal... <laughs> phenomenal that's the one yeah that too yes i've got it for once uh, we had that word amount of responses i'm not going to try and say it um with multiple suggestions we had people saying go for curved points uh, people go for wide points and things like that after weighing up all the pros and cons and speaking to people um we've decided to go with the uh y points and Why? someone might, yeah, someone might shoot me if I get this wrong. I think it's something called an S238 special curve, which attached to the Y points, it brings them back parallel to go straight. What are you laughing at? Special points. <laughs> yeah, shut up. Um, uh, which brings them back parallel to go into the TMD. So now I've ordered the... Um, most of the points. I haven't ordered the Y the Y point or the special one yet, because there's a couple of things I need to point up with that. And also, I'm going to be delving into this, switch, you know, motorized switches and things, which is well out of my comfort zone. Um, I'll be leaning on a few people on how to do all the wiring for that, because you need like um, a CDU. Don't ask me what. Remind me, whatever that is. Thank you, Jason, for putting me onto that. And obviously the switches, which I'm going to put here somewhere. And I might even ask Jason to help draw me up a board. <laughs> Jason. I like his board. His board is gorgeous. Go and check it out on the, um, Barnabas Junction. Um, but yeah, wiring all that up. Uh, it's something I've never done before. Well, most of this I've never done before. But Not yeah, thank you so much, Jason, for your tips there. Um, but again, the incredible amount of people that came back. You are all literally amazing, and I genuinely mean that because, like we've always said, even a year on now, we're still newbies at this. I'm obviously still making mistakes. <laughs> wrong gauge. Wrong gauge, wrong curves, yeah. wrong this, wrong that. I'm just wrong, full stop. But yeah, thank you so much. So, yeah, Grace is going to get on with painting these mountains, not those ones. That would be rather weird, wouldn't it? I ain't promising, I ain't promising. It would be weird painting those mountains, wouldn't it? Let's not go there. Um, so yeah, we received the first point today, which is the right hand one to bring it out into the TMD. And he's already put it on. Um, so I'm going to get that set up so we can actually run a loco again round this inner curve. Because um, I need to get the cleaner on it. Um, and then once I've got that in place, as the points arrive, I can get them set in place. Um, get this wide point and these special curves. No laughing. I said no laughing that you laughed. Get get that in place and then hopefully get an idea on how to sort this um this yard out because I really really want to make it look like a proper yard. Gravel, dirt, oil, people milling about and everything like that. So I'll pass you back to Grace now. Ooh, automatic glasses. Why'd you pass it back to me? We're going off. So you I can just do didn't know I just didn't know. You can it. do the finish off. There you go. Turn away from it. Bye. Go on. In you go. So guys. I suppose I'm finishing it off as always. See, who does the hard work here, guys? Please, please, as always, you never fail to disappoint. Please let us know in the comments. You never fail to disappoint. That is incredibly insulting to our viewers. Well, they never fail. No, you've just actually insulted them. What was the saying? <laughs> Apologise first. You know what I'm right, guys. Do you know what I meant? Please help me out in the comments. Apologise. It's too late to apologise. I didn't mean that, guys. Never fail to amaze, I think, in possibly. No, never. 
disappointed in it. Anyway, guys, we're going to go on this way. Hopefully, you know what I meant. Um, but you always come at it when I need it. So please help me out in that little box. Um, and if you're new to us, a very big welcome. The subscribe button. I think we've Rob's now actually found something that it's actually at my bottom. Um, and always a like is always appreciated as well. Gentlemen, please like, comment, and subscribe. That's what you're looking for. Yes. Might your, be. Your brain's not working today. I just went from the internet out. Anyway, guys, we're going to go on because clearly a domestic's about to happen. Sorry you're missing this one. Catch our lives for the real live domestics. And we'll see you in a bit, guys. Bye for now. Say bye, Grace. Not the end. It's not the end. It is. It's at the end. No, it's not the end of the whole thing. We've just started. No, this is getting uploaded now. Oh, you're uploading it as this? Yes, yes. So, say bye, Grace. I'm not going to this time because you didn't. Okay.